Okay, greeting guys. Welcome back to another episode on your Dr. DIY's channel. So in today's video, we are going to basically uh, dismantle this cooker hood because it is not performing at its optimum condition. So if you can see, this is a tissue paper. If I put the tissue paper here, you see there's no suction here. But if I put the tissue paper here, there's also no suction. So we are going to dismantle this and see what is the problem inside. So we will be taking the airflow measurement device from the exhaust outlet. So as you can see, it's the lower. Okay, so currently we are set to airway. So the lower is basically located here, so it sucks the air from both sides left and right, okay, and then it blows it out from here, okay, so as you can see, it is very ugly, okay, so I think, so we need to further investigate why it's not so strong, so we need to open up more, okay, so we have basically connected just to press, okay, just to press, how is it, so from my understanding, this is off, so speed number one, the fan is not turning off, the fan is not turning off, so if I use speed number two, I need to push, then we'll be connected, right, and then if I use speed number three, the fan is in full mode, let's measure how much we are in, okay, so let's measure it now. So upon checking this capacitor, which is supposed to be 9 microfarad, right, it is showing here a value which is way off. Okay, so it means this capacitor is, uh, is faulty, right, so we need to change this capacitor. Okay, we managed to get a capacitor, but of course we could not find 9 microfarad, so we got for 10 microfarad, okay, so let's do the measurement huh? so i'm going to set at okay so this is for so if you see the old one okay so if you see the old one of course it is not nine microfarad never close to it okay so it's showing a value which is a bit off so confirm this is spoiled but looking at the new one now which is just purchased so the two wires are touched i'm pressing it huh? so i'm pressing it so we are getting 10 micro farad okay a quick update one of the most crucial part in the cleaning process of this cooker hood was this uh, this blower, right? So we are going to coat this with a ceramic coating. Okay, this is a ceramic coating, right? So we are just going to spray and just wipe. Okay guys, so the cooker hood has been uh, assembled together now. A few modifications were done to improve the quality of the airflow. Okay, these two bars were removed because they were destructing the airflow from the middle to the side, left and right. So now, if you on, you can see uh, the tissue. Uh, it gets sucked here. It gets sucked here. Okay. And so what the modifications are very simple. First thing first pick up this filter. This is the main one, so this is the left unit, and this is the right unit. So, so you can see this bar was actually here. The blower is here. So when the bar is here, there was a little amount of space for the air to go through. So we have removed the bar on top of that. We have added a flexi. So this flexi is directly from the lower going to the left side. And the similar way we did on the right side. Okay. 
So it's fun, so you can actually do it. So that's all the smoke doing 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 all the sm